everyone. Thank you for joining me on Miss Chitty 18. Today I'm going to do a Chanel haul for you guys. I have the four collections here for you and first I will show you the products and at the end of the haul I'm going to be doing a tutorial as usual. So please stay tuned. I'm going to get started and show you my first product. The first product is Chanel's Luminating Powder and it's in the color it's beige laminating powder with shimmer this is the box and came in this uh, weller pouch as usual and this came with also a brush Chanel's brush okay and this is the product it's a beautiful beige tan striped uh, eliminating powder and it has a, a I think silver overspray silver sparkles it's a beautiful highlighter and um, I don't like the overspray but I only scrape a little bit to the top part but because I don't like the uh, shimmer it's so great I will just swatch that for you guys the second product I have here is a blush um, it's a powder blush it's called the rose initial number 72 that's the box and this is this came also in, in this velvet pouch and this is the product sorry for the fingerprints and you open it it's a beautiful a pink blush I'm going to use this in the tutorial so you can see all right the third product is a eyeshadow it's called the soft touch eyeshadow number 69 and it's called black star so this is the box of this um, eyeshadow okay it's a single eyeshadow this is a black eyeshadow with some silver shimmer there were so many single eyeshadows but I have similar color eyeshadows in my collection so I just picked this up I will use this in the tutorial you can see okay so this is the eyeshadow the next product uh, is a lip definer precision lip definer and uh, it's number 54 and it's called Amarante. I'm very bad at French pronunciation but you can see the name over here and it comes with a beautiful I mean it comes with a um, sharpener as usual Chanel sharpener this is a pre precision lip definer number 54 and it's called Amarante. I don't know how to pronounce French but you can see I will put everything in the description box all right so it's a I will show you how it looks a very beautiful plummy color this pencil has a one side brush and the other side is the pencil so I love Chanel's pencil pencils lip pencils the third product of this um, collection I have here is a nail color it's called frenzy it's a beautiful beigey gray color and it's a beautiful uh, office appropriate color and I have this on today and I have a butter London top coat on top of this so this is the beautiful nail color there were um, other nail colors like the, they have like um, one darker vampy color and also a nice uh, red tone color uh, pinkish red color but I didn't get any of those because I have similar color in my um, nail polish collections but I love this one I like to have uh, Chanel's nail polishes but this is a beautiful office appropriate color okay next product is a Rouge Coco hydrating um, lip color uh, in the color in uh, number 45 I don't know how to pronounce this you can see and it's a beautiful plum lipstick this is the lipstick it's so buttery and very beautiful on the lips 
it's very good for the fall season I'm going to swatch this for you beside the lip liner you can see it's a beautiful plum color with some golden undertones to it so pretty all right next product is a um, rouge allure allure extra d gloss and in the color number 68 and it's called true blonde I don't want to miss out this uh, formula of Chanel's uh, lip glosses I really love it it's so pretty and this is the um, lip gloss I love this sleek case it's very beautiful and it's so heavy and uh, steady okay and that's the wand and the gloss I'm gonna swatch this for you guys so that's the color and it's beautiful um, it's pure shine intense color it's very shiny on the lip and it's going to give you a very nice um, a natural look to the lip so I really really love this color okay so that's that the next product is a waterproof long-lasting eyeliner number 70 uh, this is with black shimmer this is the box okay and I will show you the waterproof liner so that's the liner and it's a retractable pencil and I will swatch that for you so this is the one it has some silver shimmer to it and one side is a retractable pencil the other side comes with a sharpener built-in sharpener so you don't have to sharpen with another sharpener it has a sharpener okay so that's that and I don't know which uh, this one is part of the uh, fall collection because I bought this in uh, Neiman Marcus in USA um, maybe it's exclusive to Neiman Marcus but I'm not very sure about it so this is um, I don't think uh, this is a part of the fall collection or no, I'm not sure okay but I also picked up uh, the regular um, limited edition ones that I missed out which is a nail polish I think this is from last year and I missed out this one um, this is called number 529 graphite it's a beautiful graphite color it's a shimmery nail polish I know many of you know about this one but I missed out this one but I got a chance they had this one and I purchased it all right I also picked up uh, Illusion de Ombre, the cream uh, eyeshadow from Chanel, uh, which is called number 89 Vision. I bought this in Vancouver um, because the lady from the counter, the sales associate, she's very nice and uh, uh, she showed me this color. It's a beautiful, it's in the color number uh, 89 and it's called Vision. I can't wait to use this in the tutorial it's so pretty gold um, cream eyeshadow I think this is a limited edition and she had only one and she showed me this one so I picked it up it's very beautiful okay and she's so lovely because I always shop Chanel's products so she gave me one limited edition blush which is number 59 first go something she gave me this one okay I think um, lighter skin tone people can pull off this one I'm going to keep it in my kit okay so that's it going for you guys and that's the end of my um, Chanel fall collection and also some of regular collection uh, all right so please stay tuned I'm going to take you to the tutorial and show you how uh, these products work on my skin First, I'm going to use Too Faced Shadow Insurance Glitter Glue Primer. Now, I'm going to take Chanel's Soft Touch Eyeshadow uh, number 69. It's called Black Star. And I'm also going to take my Chanel's Contour Shadow Brush number 26. This is a very good size brush to apply this uh, darker color. I'm going to take a little bit in my brush and apply this to the lip. motion. 
we're just going to dab it slowly slowly to the lid because this has lots of glitter particles because I don't want to get so much fallout so that's why I'm just dabbing into the lid and turning my brush this way this is just a simple tutorial but, but I just wanted to show you how the shadow looks like on my lid So I pretty much cover my um, underneath the crease area with this eyeshadow. Now I'm going to use Chanel's waterproof long lasting uh, eyeliner pencil in uh, number 70 black shimmer. This is going to go on my top lash line. It's a retractable pencil. I'm just going to apply this to my uh, top lash line. Um, I think I have a very minimal fallout from this uh, shadow, but I'm going to wipe uh, with my um, makeup remover wipe Just to clean up this area Before I apply a foundation All right for my face I'm going to be applying my channels perfection Lumia foundation and I'm going to apply with Sigma's F80 synthetic kabuki brush just going to use just one pump like that and I'm just going to apply this to my face now I'm just going to brush my brows I think my brows are all right I don't need to fill in Alright, now I'm going to use this uh, illuminating powder with shimmer from Chanel and I'm going to take the light color in my Chanel's um, eyeshadow brush and I'm just going to apply this to the uh, brow bone area just a tiny bit and also the inner corners. Now I'm going to curl my lashes. I'm going to be using my Chanel's eyelash curler. I love this eyelash curler, you know, it's really good. All right, now I'm going to use my Chanel's Sublime Additional Mascara to my top and bottom lashes. Just did a one coat because I'm going to apply some false lashes after this. I'm going to use um, Ardell's uh, Demi Wispies number 120 uh, and I'm going to use Revlon's um, Lash Adhesive. I'm just going to apply these lashes. I'm going to do my face now. I'm going to be using my Chanel's um, powder blush in number 72 Rose Initial, and I'm also going to use my blush brush from Chanel, uh, which is number four. I'm just going to apply this to the cheeks. Whatever left on the brush, I'm just going to dab a tiny bit. I'm going to be using my Chanel's Illuminating Powder uh, with Shimmer to my uh, highest part of my cheekbone. I'm going to be using the same brush, Max uh, Blush Brush to apply this. I'm just going to take it because I don't like the shimmer. I'm just uh, taking it from the top part here.
all right now I'm going to do my lips I'm going to be using my Chanel's um, precision lip definer and uh, the color of this one is I don't know how to pronounce it's Amaranti something and it's number 54 just going to fill in the lips first outline the lips and then I'll fill it Alright, now I'm going to use the Rouge, Chanel's Rouge Coco um, Hydrating Cream Lip Color, um, which is Catrice. Alright, I love this lipstick, it's so creamy and very nice and it has a golden tone to it. Okay, now I'm going to take my Chanel's uh, lip brush, which is number 33, and I'm going to even out uh, the lipstick and because this area I want to have uh, on uh, like a blend out uh, the lipstick here. 